Oh god, oh god, he has my head! Tell him to give me back my head! Look, he's a mean bastard, alright? I don't tell him what to do. Just tell him to give me back my head before I hurt myself! Oh! 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 That's gonna bruise. Hey, what's up YouTube land? MGo here, the freaking geek himself, and today we will be reviewing the Transformers Reveal the Shield Voyager class Lugnut. So here we are. There he is, and we'll get right down to it. Take a quick look at the box. See here. Got a picture of Lugnut. Reveal the Shield. Cross Cell. The obligatory product shots. Back here. Got a cool picture of lug nuts. You got the bio. Read it. Read it. Hooray! And we're done. Boom! And moving on. So here we have lug nuts in his what they call a long range bomber mode. And very nicely done. I really like the way this looks. I like the little shark mouth design here, which is indicative of the. Uh, the Atomic Lug Nut, the, the repaint we got from uh, Animated. Just very cool. A lot of nice detail. You got the turbines going on in there. This whole front piece is done in that red translucent plastic as well as the uh, windshield. Come back here, you have the LU6 and U7. Oh, I wonder what that means. So clever. So clever. It says it on the wings too. But very, very nicely done. One little feature he has is you can open up this back hatch here, and he has a little missile launcher, so if you want, you can make him projectile poop a missile. A little red missile. Or if not, you can bring it down, you can drop the turd bomb from up above, or you can rotate this whole section here, and he can launch his turds overhead. Boom! Turd bomb. Okay. You just bring that back down. You can close it back up. So. Yes, very cool. Now for comparison, we'll bring in his animated counterpart. You can see here, uh, pretty much the same length, but as far as wingspan goes, Reveal the Shield Lug Nut definitely has a much more impressive wingspan. So. Again, really, really nicely done. I, I love the way this figure, uh, this figure came out. Does have rolling wheels. Got these guns up front here that can, you can pivot them up and down. And that's pretty much it. But so, so cool. So, we'll get down to transformation, so. What you want to do? You want to grab this whole bottom section right here? Grab it. And extend it down. Now you're going to take the hips and you're going to Rotate them, like so, and then rotate the leg, and then you're going to take this panel, bring it up, it'll snap into place, you bring the foot down, open up the toes, like so, and then you take this whole assembly here and you just push it forward, like that, and that completes your leg. So you just do it again on the other side, rotate the hip. Rotate the leg, bring this up, bring the foot down, open up the feet, and bring this forward, and there you have your legs. Now if you want to do his arms, you can do his arms now, why not? You just take the arm, you rotate them, take this panel, fold it up, Take this section of the wing, fold it up, you're going to come here, and pull the fingers out, and then just rotate this whole section out, and there you have a hand. And you can just bring it down. Over here, oh, I forgot to show off the shield that he can reveal, it's right here on the end of the wing. I don't know if we can get any rub symbol action going, but we'll try. Let's see, let's see, let's see, no, my hands are still too cold. Damn my frigid hands! 
My hands don't know the meaning of warmth. <laughs> God. But anyway. Transform the arm. <laughs> Rotate it. Bring up this panel. Fold this up. Bring up the fingers. Rotate it out. And there you have the other arm. You can bring that down. And now, take this section. Fold it up. Take this whole rear section. Bring it down. And then as you push it forward, you'll get a little automorph. And this whole front section will open up, and it will reveal the head. Very, very cool. And they can take this whole torso section here, and bring it up, and it'll snap into place. They can take this and just push it all the way in. Now, if you notice he doesn't have the hunchback, what you want to do is you want to take this whole assembly here, and this will move forward, and I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but there's a little notch right there that this will tab into and lock that in place so now he has his hunch back and they can finish pushing that in and there you have it there's lug nut in robot mode Oop. you can take this little fin here and fold it down if you want but there he is there he is in robot mode, and this thing looks so, so cool. Now, for articulation, his head's on the ball joint, so you have good movement there. His mouth even opens and closes, which is, <laughs> I thought, a very nice touch. The arm's a little limited. They don't, this whole section doesn't rotate, it just raises up from here, and that's as far as his arm will go. And as far as uh, outward movement, it's on a ratchet, but it'll only go up that far. So a little limited range of movement, but and it does pivot. And you got your elbow here. The fingers are articulated. This whole section right here is one is one piece, so you can move that up and down. But each finger is individually articulated there at that at that knuckle, and the thumb also is articulated. And you got a waist joint. Hips can pretty much go wherever you want. You got a swivel. Bend at the knee and the feet. Up and down. And a very good pivot. So Good articulation on this guy. So you can pretty much pose him however you want. Now he does have a feature. He has a little spring-loaded punch gimmick. So you push this little purple button here and boom! He has it on both hands. Boom! So, he does have that punch, which apparently is a very devastating punch. Mascot found this out personally, because apparently when I brought him home, he felt the need to assert his uh, dominance. Hey. Why is this camera on? I'm going to here. Who, who left this camera on? Did he leave this camera on? The hell? There is no reason why this camera should be left on. Maybe I should turn it off. Maybe I... The hell? I so deserve a raise. Wow, that's that's unfortunate. Maybe I will give him a raise. <sighs> anyway. Again, very, very cool figure. Now we can still make use of the turd missile. You can take it, plug it in there. You can bring this section out. And rotate it, and you can take it and shoot it over his head, although it does make him a lot more, uh, <laughs> not exactly a space saver in this mode, but you have the option. Or you can kind of go the, uh, P.O.G. kind of had this idea of kind of having it as like an, kind of an underslung gun there if you want. Oh, oh. Always push that button by accident. 
Or basically, you can just have him poop a missile. <laughs> yeah, whatever. It's up to you. It's like, oh, I have to go. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, people. <laughs> this train has fallen off the tracks. This train has been derailed. I don't know what to do. But anyway, for comparison, there he is again next to his animated counterparts. You can see a little bit taller at the head. An animated lug nuts. And we'll bring in the other animated character to kind of get the uh, the movie-fied treatment. Next to Lockdown. You can see Lockdown's way taller than Lugnut. And just for the hell of it, there's next to Blitzwing. And he's still shorter than Blitzwing. God. And here. He can actually hold the uh, animated Lugnut staff. If you so choose, you can do it. You have the option. You can hold on to it. He holds on to it securely. So you can have a staff of doom. Why not? Why not have him raise him up? All hail Megatron! I don't know. It's actually not bad. I might leave him in this pose. <laughs> I might just put him up on the shelf just like this. That's pretty darn cool. But yeah, awesome, awesome figure. I would definitely recommend that you pick this guy up if you see him. He is damn, damn cool. And this review is going out to my buddy Lugnut1995. You rock, buddy. He does great stop motions. You should check him out. So I think that's pretty much all there is to say. So there is the Transformers Reveal the Shield Voyager Class Lugnut. And this is MGO. Rolling out.